my god all right guys welcome back to another video Manolo here so today we're going to be talking about how i got my car back sitting right here as you can see the police actually found it the same day it got stolen and if you don't know what i'm talking about make sure you watch the last video or my previous video and you'll see how my car got stolen so pretty much what happened was they found it the same day and it was totaled yeah all right sucks it was crashed into a pool and they said they tried to contact me so they just put it in the lot and then i had to pay for it to get out here she is now I literally got it back last night which is a day after the last video and for all you guys that don't believe this is a type s got a type s badge got the braze bar right there oem and the type s side skirts I was reading like a lot of people are like telling me it's not even the Type S, look at the base wheels. But you are wrong, it is a Type S. The damage is in the front and it's pretty bad guys. Like I am heartbroken, I cried, I was angry at the same time and yeah. But we're gonna go pick up a new car today and I probably already put it up in the thumbnail so you already know what it is. So I'm gonna show you guys the damage now and yeah, here we go. And here we go. That's right guys, you guys got pranked! Pranked on April Fools, man. I got so many of you guys, man. Like my phone literally blew up after I posted that last video. I had people texting me, DMing me, and freaking people calling me that haven't even talked to me in like months. I think that was the best April Fools prank I've ever done ever. And the thing is, I thought about it last second, like my original plan was to make the car smoke somehow, like a smoke bomb or something, but I couldn't find any. And then come March 31st, I woke up, I'm like, you know what? What if I made a video of someone stealing my car? And I was like, dude, that's the perfect plan, man. Like, I just need somebody to drive my car. So if you follow me on Instagram, that's pretty much why I was asking everybody, like, whoever drives a stick, you can come drive my car if you want. I had a buddy of mine with the S2000 drive it, and he let me rip it in his car. So if you still want a chance to drive the RSX, make sure you follow me on Instagram, DM me. Just DM me about it, and I'll tell you all the details. If you're new to the channel, this is my RSX Type S here, obviously. And this is my brother's G35 here. Not too much going on in both cars, but gonna start working pretty soon. I've been on a long vacation. So, you know, stuff's coming for sure now. Like, all I've been doing is like stalling with like takeover meets. Cause I've just been on vacation, man. But yeah, I go to takeover meets too. So, if you wanna check that out, subscribe. Go check them out. Damaged on the car when it got stolen. Oh my god, no! <laughs> but yeah, guys, hopefully you guys enjoy the video of me driving S2000. This is my first time driving S2000, thanks to Young Snoop. And yeah, hope you guys enjoy the video. This guy, sweet. All right, guys, welcome back to another video. It's Namalo here. This is the guy that stole my RSX in the last video. <laughs> We're still here, like filming. He's gonna let me rip his S2000 here. What you got done to it? Uh, it's not too much. Lightly modified. I got dual exhaust. Uh, cold air intake. That's sweet. pretty much it. Got some nice wheels. Dope, man. Are those real? It yeah, says yeah. forged. They must be real, man. Oh, they are. Volk Racing. You didn't know that? <laughs> Dang. I know they're racing stuff, but I don't know if they're real or not. I'm not sure. Sweet. Yeah, look at this dope thing. Dope S2000. This guy never really brings it out, but he brought it out today for a video. Bye bye, bro. Dude, I thought it was unlocked already. Oh, dude, this thing is so small. Yeah. Oh my god. Bigger than a Miata, though, huh? Yeah, a Miata, dude. I, it was like, I was, in the Miata, I was like this. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, but like, how do you like it? Just the uh, steering wheel. The steering wheel? Yeah. No, it's fixed. We can't oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, you gotta press the button. Pull in clutch. Press the button. Huh? Or yeah, just hold on to it until it starts. Yeah. Dope. I need that. I remember I was at a dealership when I was like 16, 17. I got in one. Mm -hmm. And I fit fine, dude. Like, I don't know what's wrong today, though. Um, so you want to reverse, you push down on it, and then you go to the right. Yeah. I'm uh, got it. Got it, man. Let's and see. the engagement point is going to be like towards the end. Yeah, I feel it already. <laughs> Damn. I guess like a race clutch type shit. It's pretty hard. Oh my god. Dude, I feel like Shaq in this thing. I don't want to scrape your car like you scraped in line. We'll be even. <laughs> yeah, I should have scraped. Oh my god. 
my god. Oh my god, bro. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, dude. I didn't even much hit it. That thing felt amazing, bro. Dang. No way. Do I only went to like seven or eight or something? Yeah, I only went to like eight. Dang. This is like I can barely see him like. <laughs> Dude, look at my knees, bro. Look at this, guys. You ever drove a S2K before? No, nah, dude. This is my first time. See if I can make it. Turn. You think I'll make it? Yeah, I think so. No, nah, I'm just go for it. You got it right now. <laughs> no. It's all good, man. It's all good. All oh, sweet. It's easy. Restart. I'm not gonna make it, bro. I'm not. I'm good. Yeah, you good, bro. You good. You good. Sweet. So. Oh my God, dude. I think you'll beat me, <laughs> to be honest. And I think it still has like potential because I need the valve adjustments. It's loose valves right now. Yeah, dude, I did that to mine. It was like a lot quieter too, like in cold starts. Yeah. I did that like at about 10,000 miles ago. It's still pretty good. How much did you charge you or you did it yourself? Oh, dude, I did it myself. It's one of the things you can learn by yourself. You just gotta have the balls to like you gotta actually. Have the right tool. Yeah, it's just a fuel gauge and one of those I think like the tool for it or you could just use a, I think it's a 10 millimeter or 8 millimeter and the flathead. But that's a lot harder, but it's doable. At the same time, man, you don't want to mess up. So you like double check. Oh, freak. Oh, dude, I thought that was a car behind me. That's a Corolla. Uh, I see why I like your clutch better. <laughs> <laughs> Dope, man. You take it out the ignition. Oh, okay. <laughs> Dope, man. Thank you. Yeah, man. That's all good. That was fun, dude. Hey, guys. Remember to like and subscribe. And same your Instagram, dude. Um, Young Snoop. Yeah. Uh, I don't post too much, but follow me if you want. Sweet, man. I'll put it on the screen for you guys. And link it down in the description. And thank you, guys. See you guys in the next one.